Okay, so for some reason, I have antifreeze in here. It's kind of been like that for a while uh, since I got the car. I haven't really got a chance to drain it out. And then when I got the car epoxied, uh, it kind of made a mess of things. So I'm going to go ahead and empty this thing out. Thanks. Smells like ass. So now we're gonna get this in. One in the back actually looks like shit. And these speakers are not that great. So I went on CJ Pony Parts and I've got the uh, tray kit that they have with the Pioneer. I've actually had it in my garage for a little bit. Um, but now it's time to get it in. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna disconnect all the wiring in the back for the speakers. Oh wait, let's get back. <laughs> Perfect, so now that we're in the back, we're gonna disconnect all the wiring for the speakers. All you gotta do, in my case, I didn't even connect them correctly. I just put them right in there. So pull that out and then you just remove the speakers. It should be four screws. In this case, I have a zip tie. <laughs> so we'll get those off. Now that you have both speakers off, you can just pull this out real easy uh, from the top. All right, let's get over there. So you just pull the rotted up nasty paper, wood, whatever the hell you want to call it. And then you take the screws out, of course. And it's really easy. Now I'm going to put the speakers in. And then we will get the CJ Pony Parts speaker pods in. Alright, these came in the kit. Real cheap, $169 for both. Uh, including the speaker pod.
four screws are on. I actually used Harbor Freight nuts and bolt assembly. I got this for a couple of dollars. It worked out very well. And uh, the ones that they came with actually sucked really bad. Um, they gave me some shit that looks like it belongs on the wall, like in some drywall, but this works out perfect. All right, let's get the rest of this shit done. Wrap it up. Dang, so now that they're both installed, I'm gonna go ahead and connect all the wiring. I connected the one to the left first, and then I'm gonna test out the speakers before we get the pods in, just to make sure that everything is bumping and uh, good to go. All right, let's test out this speaker. You just took it off the line, no mileage. Today was definitely a very uh, fun and uh, eventful day. I was able to get a couple things done. Uh, things that I have wanted to do uh, that were simple, but they were still there nonetheless. Uh, make sure you keep watching and that you check out our other videos. Uh, make sure you leave a thumbs up and a comment. That way I can respond back to you guys. That's all for today.